What's up? Welcome back to another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Um, I'm not in the same place I was when I ended the last one. Um, if you remember the last one, we drive, we'd see like, the palm trees like flashing through the buildings. So it was a bug. I had to update drivers, and then I drove around just to make sure it was done. So there, now you're up to date. That's all I've done really. So I drove my little my my around. So what we are going to do is we're going to do a hang out with Judy. We're gonna go have this pizza party that Judy promised us. I'm gonna drive the little my my over there. Oops. There. Probably care more about the game than my ugly face. Probably good we have this little my my. It's hard to miss turns now. Cause it goes so damn slow. Yeah, I don't care. Get out there and enjoy the sun. So pretty. Wrong coast view right now. Still haven't fast traveled in this, so I'm trying to make this a 100% or whatever full playthrough with no fast travel. I wish I could deny his phone call, but it's gonna answer it. Do have a look the area. Don't care. Lost with the it's probably gonna switch my stupid mission too. Okay, good. It didn't switch my mission. I thought it was gonna switch the mission for me. Oh. That's what I get for looking over at OBS. little frame drop here. Must be a shit ton going on. This is the only area that gives me a little trouble just because there's a shit ton going on. Oh no. Sorry my my. Dang, keep going straight. Just crossing all of those, why not? Traffic jam going on here, I guess. Ah, uh, trying to merge down to one lane. People don't know how to zipper merge. Oh. Why is that car stopped? Holy shit, it's fast now. <laughs> this car is pissing me off. Gosh, my 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 is bone now. Look at that. Gosh, that sucks. I need to figure out how to fix cars. This car and my other car toasted. When I get to Judy's, may I call the other one to see if it's fixed? Let's see if I just have to wait a little bit to get it fixed. Or if I actually have to take it to a repair shop. Excuse me. Oh shit. Humping it. Damn it. Oh, I think I need to go. Excuse me. <laughs> I 
My little clown car over here. Looks like I put this clown car through a meat grinder. Sorry. Judy at. Uh, I guess Judy's apartment, but it's in the evening. It's 7 p.m. On Charter Street. Oh, yeah. I remember coming here. I like how the mocks are looking out for it. I'm not afraid of anyone, you know? Cool. Pizza's getting cold. What's up, Tom? We're in the kitchen. Thanks for the update. You made it. Good. Grab a seat. Um. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. She barely got me pepperoni and extra cheese. Hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? Were you and Evelyn close? Yeah. Blew up in her face when she showed up back at Clouds. She was supposed to be long gone, the one who got away. But deep in my heart, I was glad to see her back. Feel like such a gonk now. How are you? Okay, I guess, but you know, sad as hell. How was that? You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? Oh. Suddenly comes naturally to you, doesn't it? Yeah, odd. Given how much work I gotta put into it. By the way. Boris didn't show up for work today. Or yesterday. Interesting. No shit, I wonder why. I got sick, maybe. Or hit the lottery jackpot. Bought himself a ticket to the moon. Hmm, could be anything. Done saying hello to each other? Sorry, sorry. So what's the plan? Judy? I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't nice. it? Nice. What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. Meanwhile, you'll air it out later. Effer, I hate this lady. Fine, I'll sit by the window. May I throw you out the window? The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. For you uncultured folks, unfamiliar with English customs, fox hunting is a treasure. How'd you ever come up with this? Learned how the behavioral chip works at Clouds. Always seemed like they must be pretty easy to modify. I'm surprised I didn't get the idea the moment we walked into Michael's office. Count yourself lucky. I have a feeling we're about to fight Tom. Tiger Claws would sooner dig those chips out of the dolls with screwdrivers than let an idea like this run its course. Uh, Alright. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally, someone said it. 
Tom? Pulled that sequence from a Kung Fu training virtue. Oh, no. Not convinced. If I'm to count on ninja dolls, I'm gonna need to see some real action. Like, wanna spar? What else? Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. It's on now! <laughs> what the? Ah! Hey, I got shot in on first. There? Some nice cardio. work, Judy. Outdid yourself. If you were to sell that, you'd be the richest Judy in the NUSA. Please. Plenty of killing machines in the world. I don't want to turn more people into them. After this, ships are getting micro-nuked. You got something to say? Just say it. Who, me? This is my impressed face. Can you okay, <laughs> okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Okay. Bosses will give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again and having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato is the man you gotta get to. Hiromi Sato. I'm guessing he's head of the Tire Claws? Cloud's real boss. Never mind. He rarely shows, but you can't so much as sneeze without him finding out. Claws trust him, respect his opinion. He is one of them. Hmm. We can try to convince right. him, but it's doubtful. We stand a better chance by injecting him with a dose of fear. Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment. H8 Mega Tower. Topmost floor. It's a penthouse. Almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. Oh, sorry, I'm getting word from my producer that if I start explaining what a median is, we will lose most of our viewer base. So I think it's time for my final word. And I will try to keep it as simple as possible. My plan just might work. <laughs> Michael, I take it you're on board too. And I don't know how Wouldn't be wasting my time here if I wasn't. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I, I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I'm with it all the way. V? Hell yeah. Tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? V, get it. Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Hell yeah. Save the gratitude for later, please. Oh, I'll shit, set up not the good. meet with me and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Red Menace, Purple Force. Oh, shit. After making I'm scared, B. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do will usually come to the price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Uh, no. Judy, for real. No, don't want to hear it. But uh, be, be, not a word. Uh, 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 v, everything okay? I'm guessing no. V, you don't look so hot. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. Fine. What the hell, V? 
You, like, sick? It's past. Forget about it. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. I mean, I feel like it's like 8 o'clock. <laughs> morning to sleep. It's 6 in the morning. <laughs> I love Judy. Oh. Hmm. I figure out. Ham and cheese sandwich and a cup of coffee. Uh, the pepperoni pizza I ordered. Nice. Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Interesting. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. Huh. Interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. Then I guess you should feel right at home. <laughs> Chick's got taste. That all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. Well, well, well. The Bushido collection in BD format. First three are collector's items nowadays. Someone likes getting their feet wet. Don't need to be an expert to tell the gears pro. Huh. Well, you sure are a funny guy. Who would have thought? Let's go back to basics, shall we? Perilous future. Electropunk? I'd rather puke out my ears. I <laughs> got it. TV next to the turret. I like that. Can I do anything up here? Oh. Oh. Ah, uh, this is where Judy and I sat the one time. Okay. Alright, my busted ass he had is. Okay, let's call my Caliburn. Okay. It looks fixed. Yeah, it's fixed. Okay. So apparently just over time they get fixed. Okay. I need some more money. I only have 50, 50k. Okay, I think I'm going to go out to Pan Am. Yeah, I'm excited to see what Pan Am's mission does. Oh, wait, 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 no. I got a call from... Um, hold on. I got a call when I was trying to drive. From somebody I've been excited to get a call or a text from. Ozav, hey, got your number from a friend. Heard you're good at what you do. It's what the God's honest truth did, and I've got to get you to call me if you're interested. Okay, I'm going to go see Ozav. That's what I'm going to do. I've been excited for this for a long time. It's V. Where'd you get a gig for me? You heard right. I need.
need a driver. Okay. Mm -hmm. And for what exactly? Oh, you know, this and that. I got a few errands to run. A couple of friends that need paying a visit. The usual. Listen, I'm a straight shooter. So let me cut right to the chase. I heard you're the best in town. Thing is, I like working with the best. And I know the best don't come cheap. I'm not gonna get into the nuts and bolts, cause if what they say about you is true, you can handle anything. So let's get this settled. You got what it takes, or are they wrong about you? All right, I'm in. Japan town, then, by the market entrance. Give a few honks and I'll stroll up. Later, B. I think this mission is, yeah, sending the clowns. Dang, I was hoping it just update right away. I'm doing this mission right away. I've been excited for this one. Stay there, little guy. I feel like I always, oh shit. I always go this way. I never go like straight in that intersection. I feel like I'm stuck in high gear or something. Gosh, this town or this area is just so windy. What happens if I hold? <laughs> This is where a controller would be nice, because right now all I can do is press it. I can't press it lightly. Okay. supposed to you know I really don't want to do this but thank you forget how you honk I think it's Q Ah, oh, there he is. So this guy has a grenade for yes. a nose. Oh, fuck. You didn't answer my question. Yeah, that's me. Good. Then let's go. Where to? Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. So when I was in China for a couple of months, I ate a lot of Kung Pao chicken. Doesn't it bother you? What? The grenade. You know, the one on your face. Uh, you get used to it. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I want to pick my nose. <laughs> <laughs> so, in case you didn't know, Ozob is a guy from brazil um he was he made the board game the like the D, D style board game popular and he was a really big kind of famous guy from brazil 
who was popular from the game. This was his character he created with a grenade nose. And so they integrated him to Cyberpunk 2077 as like a cameo. And if you play in Portuguese, the guy from Brazil, like actual Oza, voices him. So that's kind of cool. So I like that they gave him a little cameo. And a mission, obviously. I thought he was just going to be like in the game somewhere. GPS is pissing me off. Can't switch camera view right now. So I have no idea where he went. Oh, there it's. Grenades up your ass, too? Not bad, right? It would have been even better if you told me what you were planning from the get go. <laughs> Is that really all I had to do with you? What about my payment? What about it? Here, like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. 2700, okay. Keep your nose to the ground. I can't shoot him, I'm trying with everything I got. I can't shoot him, damn. That's all I had to do? Damn, okay. I was really hoping for more than that. Wake up, Gary. Dang. Okay, well that was an interesting mission. Dang it, I was really hoping for more than that. Okay, well. Dang, I suck. I think this is not an FPS game, so it died ten times. I wonder, remember in the beginning of the game we broke up a fight down here? I wonder if there's like designated areas where there's fights a lot. This happens to be one of them. Two thousand critical damage, nice. 
Well, this gun was bugged. I wish it was like Fallout where you could just pick up stuff that was like in your vicinity. No, oh, I want. Okay, praise Lord. You're welcome. You're giving me a fucking headache. Let's try a cigarette. Okay, my street cred up, but I nothing else. Dang it. Okay. Now we'll go help Pan Am. No. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's go meet with Pan Am. I want to take this. Since I'm going out of the Badlands. Whoa, easy. Dang, I was not supposed to go this way, I don't think. Whatever. I got a long ass way. Seven AM, everyone going to work. There's something about, I'm assuming, with those riots that we saw, like, outside Arasaka. I assume something we're gonna have to do something with that, like join in or stop them. Or... Wow, there's a lot of people going to work right now. Vista del Rey, I think? Huh, we don't come to this area much. I don't even know if I've been here before. I don't know. I mean, I assume I have. I've been to probably most areas in town, but... Oh, yeah, there's the tower. Or... What, our industrial zone. I'm getting there slowly but surely. Damn. I wonder where it is that you come in, if you play the Nomad life path, you come into Night City. I wonder where that is. For sure, I'm going to take this thing off-road, too. The... 
whatever, gravity in this game works kind of wonky, I guess. Talking about basketball. Ooh, I'm about to hit this thing nice and gnarly. Oh, no, you're not. The whole road, nice. <laughs> Dude, I didn't want to hit this guy's car. So I kind of like that. Can I drive it? Like, I can. Nice. Okay. Wish I were on the road. Okay, I can't take those. Still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the system. What's up, Mitch? Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the wrapping camp. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like it just came back from a Corpo war tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. And Saul, what about him? Nothing. For now. We're staying out of each other's hair. Okay. So he's not planning a family council. Of course he is. He just wants to keep me in the dark a while longer. I always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Come on, hop in. Everything is set. Shit, no way. Oh, this is sweet. Oh, I'm ready for this hip. Oh. Getting in too? Okay. All right, let's fire her up. Where are your armor Hold though? I'm looking up because I'm ready for that to like disintegrate away. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything ought to. Everything is dandy. Give me a moment. Okay. Oh, yes! oh dang it. I thought it was gonna dissolve away. Thing sweet in here. It's not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What do you think? At least now I know what people call them coffins. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What? No knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. Interesting. It's like a mystical oneness. If it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. I think there's a glitch. 
or a bug because it gets so bright I can't see. It's done that for in a car and I've had to switch camera angles, but I can't right now. So, if I can't look straight down, that's why. I'm trying to like, because here I get mad glared, but if I do it just right. Okay. I wonder if I... Yeah, it won't let me turn DLSS on or off. I don't know why. Whatever. This will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't need two pilots. You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Sure. Whoa. Damn. Is this uh as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Oh my god. I understand what you meant. Why? Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Just put it through a few turns. Soft ride. Seems a boat. Alright. I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. What the fuck are you doing? Either go back now, or I take the wheel. What? Okay, that she went zero to hundred real quick. Right. Yes, that's the way to do it. Right. Excellent. Now let's do some shooting. Stop and I'll activate the system. on the menu don't get excited the basilisk is a cargo ship by design but it should still be a good time all right blast those wrecks good better than dirt now Bullseye. okay practice is over Remember what I said about impulses? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, watch out now. What's happening? I jacked him. Our nervous systems are now linked. Right. Basilisk pilots working in harmony. That why I'm feeling everything doubled. It's sensory feedback. Our systems are intertwined. Would you like to try it out? Could go for that. Interesting. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. Uh, no idea how people be focused in combat. It's probably not always this intense. How about this? Interesting. No, oh, hey, it's me. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Why is there gunshots? That's the weirdest thing ever. 
I mean, it's weird that I don't know. Just have nudity off. Am I the only one who hears this gunshot? Oh, it's fuck. They found us. We have to get back to camp. They're rapping. Whole group of them, ready for a fight. They're here too, Saul. In full force. Take them out. Then haul ass here and make yourselves useful. Go straight to the camp. We have to help the fam. Oh my lord. Oh, I like to hit that guy. I'm hitting these guys, but what the hell? Is everything? Yes, you turned them to dust. Congratulations. It's time to talk. You got your clothes back on the panel? I think I'm naked. I don't know. What in hell? Do I have my clothes back on? No, I don't. <laughs> Where? Uh. Can I, like... What in the world? What in the world? Can I go loot this stuff first? Hell yeah. What in hell? Okay, I'll come back for the rest of it. If I have to leave the clan, please just say so. Oh shit. Spare me another speech of yours at the very least. I'm afraid you'll have to sit through a few more. Because from this day forward, you will lead this family by my side. I will what? I wish to do this properly, but fine. Have it your way. I was wrong. You were right. That's the truth. Okay. It never happened again. But I, I, I made a mess of so many things. You said. I know. But I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family. I don't trust not this. Not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I. Many things will have to change. Yes. And to start with, we need to leave this place quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. I will prepare our route. Congratulations. Terrible choice. I voted nay. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? Yeah, of course. Shit, after that, I don't think I can say no to you ever again. Interesting day. It's 
say the least. I feel as if I barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. Hey, come on. No, I'm serious. We all owe you. So you can count on me all the count us. Always. Good to know. Nobody's behind the bar. That I like. <laughs> Beer? Lemonade? Beer me. What are you looking for? There we go. To happy endings. Gonna miss our little escapades. Me too. On the other hand, though, who said this one was our last? V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. Pan Am, what do you... Stay in camp. Join us. Ah. Uh. It's really not that simple. You either want to or not. What's so complicated? That's the problem. What I want right now doesn't mean a thing. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought, eh, forget about it. I'll think it all over. I pro. Oh no. That ain't good. Oh, what up, girl? What the hell else do you have? Pan Am. I... B, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? Where... Where are we? You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Uh, where? We moved camp. You are safe. Everything is under control. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, V. Oh, what up, Johnny? V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Oh. Pan Am, I... It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay, V, relax. Take it bit by bit. He did not make it. What is happening, exactly? But I do not believe he was drunk this time. Tell you the whole truth. <laughs> I'm afraid I things won't be the same band, between us if I do. Hmm? Yes. V, listen to me. There is not a thing you could say to me that would change how. I mean, just cut the bullshit and tell me what's going on. Okay. You know, Johnny Silverhand. Yes, they sometimes play those oldies on the radio. Why? That's just it. Johnny's alive. He's sitting in my head. He's what? Am, am I not? Is this some sort of strange metaphor? Long story. Got a job, fucked it up. Now, Silverhand's personality construct sitting in my head. Bullshit. Yeah, well, he's not too happy about it either. Turns out we don't really mix, and it's getting worse. You are not joking. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. I gotta go. I'm feeling better, really. Wait. I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. Sorry, Mitch. Finally. We were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay?
Much better now. Thanks for your help. I'm glad to hear it. Thanks. I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. If you need help, the Aldecaldos are here for you. And that, at least, we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Want me to walk with you? Hell yeah. It's like I really answered her. I know this area. Back from the old roots. You're really safe here, though. For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. That means I'm gonna have like a 9,000 mile drive. Welcome back to the land of the living. What's up? Time Sleeping Beauty decided to join us. Hey there. I think my car was that way, though. No, oh, maybe not. I could be wrong. But it's cop. They show the car symbol but that you way. you know everything here. It is temporary. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes next. V. Back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But I am serious. How can I help? Honestly, not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks for everything. For being here for me. Take care of yourself. And let me know. Well, just please keep in touch. Okay. Interesting. I can't scan it. The scanner doesn't work. I'm like stuck in walk mode. Gotta love it. Well, since I gotta re I gotta load save anyway, this is a good place to end the episode. I feel like we got some good stuff done. Finished a couple missions. We finally got to meet Ozob. That was kind of cool. I wish his mission was longer, but. Whatever. That was a cool little, I don't know, cameo, we'll say. Moved on for the Pan Am. Had an interesting time in the tank, but hey, keep that between us. And whew, who knows? But we'll be back next time. Uh, like, comment down below. Tell me how the game's going. And until next time, good night, City. <laughs>